Victoria is bracing for another 24 hours of wild conditions with a severe weather warning issued for strong gusts. Jade Vincent is at Williamstown. Jade, there's already been trouble on the roads. Yes, Pete, the strong winds caused a semi-trailer to roll on the Calder Freeway near Kyneton earlier today. The truck driver managed to escape with just minor injuries and was taken to hospital, but both lanes of the freeway were shut down until that scene was cleared. Also, these strong gusts have sent trees coming down across Melbourne, landing on homes near power lines and across roads. And we've also heard that the Hillsville Sanctuary was forced to close because of the weather today. Melbourne also received a battering with wind gusts of up to 80 kilometres per hour. And also, the Weather Bureau says we should be prepared for plummeting temperatures and more wild winds similar to what we saw earlier this week on Tuesday. This has been a really extraordinary week of weather. It's not often that we see really intense winds for a, a whole week um, that like we've seen this week and it's going to extend into the weekend. There is a severe weather warning in place right across the state tomorrow. Pete, we can expect wind gusts again of nearly 100 kilometres per hour and conditions such as showers, hail and a possible chance of thunderstorms. But hopefully some reprieve on Sunday when those conditions are expected to clear. Pete.